Yeah, glad they went off.
doesn't seem to put it together in the rain, so. Sienna, welcome to the main report for ECI Thank TV. You so much. We're at the second round of the national series in Sydney. Yeah. Uh, you've just taken out the super class for the day. Yeah. I uh, got to be happy with that. Yeah, I'm super stoked. I just didn't really know how I was going to pan out, but yep. I was pretty happy with myself. Just tried to stay focused, and yep. yeah, it turned out pretty well. Awesome. Now you had a big stack yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Huge. Um, what what happened? Just tangled up? And yeah, so I was winning like all day and yep. just came to the final and just got so clumped up in the middle and just I was like just someone fell on me. It was just <laughs> Happens domino, all too quick. Domino effect, yep. yeah. But it was it was good. I picked myself up and came oh, back out that's today. That's awesome. Good. So obviously no major injury no, or anything no, from just it. Just raised, a, lost skin, yep. but yeah. Oh, that's good BMX blood. though, yeah. isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so what's your home track? So, home track, um, I'm just from Terrible, so yep. down Central Coast. So okay. Yeah, just got a new track there, so started riding that one, and yeah, awesome. it's good. No, that's cool. Uh, is there anybody you'd like to thank? Uh, just mainly my coach, Luke Medill. He's been training me for like 10 years now, and just he's been such a good help. Yep. And like my parents, my mum's always taken me down to these events, and yeah, it's oh, been that's so cool. good. Yeah. So, you're looking at going to the next round of the National Series? Yeah, I'll be attempting to do all the rounds. All the rounds, yeah. Yep. That, this year and try to go to Aussies and oh, yep, see yep. how that goes and yeah oh, that's cool. stay on top. Oh that's yeah. awesome. Well I appreciate your time today. Yeah, Thank you very so much. much for me. Congratulations. Thank you. Welcome to the main report for ECI TV. Congratulations on the win today at the second round of the National Series. How does today stand out from yesterday? Oh yeah, it feels good. Feels, feels real good, good to double yep. up like this. Absolutely. Yeah, um, and quicker lap time than my final yesterday. Oh really? So I went under 32, which I was stoked oh, about. That's awesome. So that was the fastest one for the day yeah, for the yep. weekend. By, by a mile, on uh, my standards anyway. Yep. So yeah, it beat my other lap times by quite a bit. That's cool. Um, so to pull that out in the final when it matters yep. most, that, uh, that means the world to me and to have my family here with uh, to watch it as well that's that's just incredible and a really special couple of days for me and I'm actually flying out to America on on Monday and I'm living over there for six months so I'm gonna miss them a lot and yep. to, yeah to have them here to watch to watch me win twice this weekend was super special so you're over for six months obviously capping it off with grands or something like that yeah yeah so basically just racing once a month hopefully yep. um, getting picked in the world's team as well and heading over to the oh, Netherlands cool. to race yep. there and then, yeah, my last race in America will be Grands, and then yes. I'll be coming home. Awesome. Well, that's right ass. Yeah. Have you been to America a few times? Yeah, or? yeah. I've been lucky enough to sort of head over a few times yep. and hit the national circuit, uh, yep. yeah, plenty. So this is my first time racing pro, so it gets real serious now. Absolutely. Um, but I feel like I'm in good form and um, in a good position to yep. do well over there. So is there any Supercross races that are happening over there, as in the, their local ones? No, nah, I don't think there's any 8 metre races uh, yep. that I know of. Okay. Uh, my first one will be Worlds if I get picked. Yes. So hopefully I can get some uh, good prep in at Chula Vista before, before Worlds. So you're um, basing yourself in California? Yeah, so... yeah. So I'll be in California staying with uh, Brandon Crane, who's a, who's yep. a friend of mine that I know through BMX. Cool. Um, and yeah, it's just going to be me and him living it up and, yep. and uh, getting some work done. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, it'll be an awesome some experience six months so obviously be the longest stint you've been over in America for. yeah 100% it's gonna be a uh, emotional day tomorrow at the airport for sure saying goodbye to the family yeah, but um, 
No, I think I'm ready for it. And I think, yep. like I said, I'm in a good position to go over there and do well. Cool. Um, but yeah, it's just uh, I haven't been uh, been away from my family for this long, and I'm definitely a, a mama's boy, so <laughs> it'll uh, yeah definitely be a new experience for me. But for sure. Yeah, I've, I've spent sort of three months over there by myself, and yeah, yeah. I was a wreck uh, when I said goodbye to them at the airport, so it's double that time now. <laughs> well, absolutely, yeah. No, nah, I'm sure I'll be able to deal with it. Yep. Um, I'm, I'm an adult now. So I, was I, like, just about to say, I don't act like one. Now. Yeah, I don't act like one, but uh, I, get, I am, so hopefully I'll be able to handle it. Yeah, I'm no, sure I will. That's cool. So today's final, you know, you picked the middle of the, the road again, and yeah. what was it, lane six? Yeah, yeah well, lane five. Oh, lane five. Everything went to plan today, yep. so I just didn't drop. Didn't drop a lap all weekend, which um, I don't think I've ever done that before. Oh, that's right. Yeah, that's so that was pretty cool. Um, and yeah, just picked exactly where I wanted to go. Yep. Um, didn't have the best gate. I had a had Hayden Fletcher next to me, and he he, he popped one off. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, I just I just stuck with it. I knew once I sort of got going, um, I could really get spinning and, and pull away from the boys. And fortunately, I did. Yes. Had uh, Matt Kay on my left as well, and he was he was hauling ass uh, down that first <laughs> Most straight. Definitely. Yeah, I mean, well, everyone was. Everyone was. It, it was a stacked final, and yep. just and that's what makes it so awesome to take take a win twice in such an awesome field like yeah. every single one of these pro riders are fast and every Absolutely. single one of these pro riders could, could go out and win it so um, for me to sort of perform when I needed to yep. yeah it's, it's, uh, that's the biggest win for me. Even a semi, both yeah. semis were virtually a final. Yeah they were stacked and being day two I was feeling a little more fatigued yes. especially in that semi final I was like oh I don't know, know how much I got left but Luckily, we had a bigger break before the final, and yeah. I was able to sort of recover myself and, and get my legs uh, ready to go for the oh, final. That's awesome. Well, congratulations for today. Thanks, mate. And good luck in America. Yeah, appreciate Hope it. You do awesome. I'll nah. be following you and, yeah, yep. and all that. So. Nah, going to be an awesome experience. So, yeah, I'm really that's looking right. forward to it. Trying awesome. to make a living. Got to do it somehow. Yeah, that's right. Living the dream. Yeah, literally. Dream of reality. <laughs> going, to the Mer going to America. So That's cool. Yeah, stoked. Awesome. Well, cool. Congratulations. Cheers, mate. mate. Appreciate it. Talk to you. Woo! Again. <laughs> G'day Kai, Gary here from ECI TV. We just thought we'd take this opportunity to have a quick chat with you. How's things going mate? Thank you for making the decision to have a quick chat with me. Um, I've been good, um, just still recovering from my crash last year but I think I'm getting there bit by bit. So the road to recovery is a long one? but you're taking it a step at a time. Exactly, exactly. Fantastic, mate. So what did you think of the racing today? Um, I think it was really good. Um, um, obviously, Jack won, which was kind of predictable, but not really. So it's good for him to take that win. Um, and Sienna as well in the girls um, was really, really nice to see. So. I think it was really good. Look, they're, they're, they're fantastic winners. It is, um, like you said, it is a little bit predictable, but in a field with elite riders like that, anything can happen. So I think they were very deserved winners in the end. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Okay, so moving along to something like the Olympics, if, uh, if you want to give us your pick for the Olympics, well, who, who would you believe, mate? <laughs> um... Okay, uh, for the guys, um, I think Anthony Dean yep. will get selected. And for the girls, my sister, Saya, obviously. <laughs> and I think um, it's a close one between Caroline Buchanan and... Um, Lauren? Yeah, Lauren Reynolds. Lauren Reynolds. Um, I think... I'm not going to answer that. <laughs> <laughs> that. That was a nice long answer for someone that wasn't going to answer it. <laughs> well done, mate. That was awesome. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay. Well, I'd just like to take this opportunity to thank you very much and wish you, and I'm sure all our viewers would like to wish you, a, uh, a speedy recovery, and everyone's thinking of you, mate. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, and I'll be doing everything I can to back, back, get back out there as soon as possible. Excellent, mate. Is there anyone you'd like to thank? Uh, my mum, my dad, my sister, and everyone else that's supported me. Fantastic. Look, thanks very much, mate. And I very much appreciate you taking the time to talk to us. No worries. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. Bye-bye.